What's up, Wayne Baron here with DarkFlakes.net on this very hot, muggy Saturday afternoon. And today we're inside of Edge Animate CC. What we're going to be doing here is, well, to start off with, if you're not using the new Adobe Edge Animate, that's fine. What I'm going to show you is not version specific. You can do this in any version of Edge Animate. So let's go ahead and check out what we're going to be doing here. So let's hit Control Enter and let's try this again there we go as you can see here we've got our uh, buttons we got home help about support and contact now whenever we click on it we've got our home help about support and contact now we can also click on the close one okay so double click double click double click double click and double click actually single click single click each time will open up single click closes each one of these all of this is is a simple toggle effect okay so what we're going to be doing let's go ahead and start a new composition okay let's go ahead and get us a button on here and let's do it 45 45 45 45 okay so now we got our first button let's go ahead and add some text to our button and this is home and let's make our text just a little bit smaller about up in there is fine drag it put it right in the center okay let's come over here grab a hold of our text and drop it right on top of our rectangle okay and that right there will make that a, the text the child of our button so this right here is our home button and this right here is just our home text so let's do home text okay so I'm not going to do all the buttons, I'm just going to do this one right here really quick so that you can see how to do this. So, okay, let's go ahead and add in our first label here, and then text here. This is our home information. Okay, let's, uh, well, let's go ahead and just drag this out a little bit more, grab a hold of our text, put it in the center, come over here, grab a hold of our text, drag it on top, and drop it. This right here is our home info, and this is our text info. Okay, that's simple. Okay, after creating this right here, let's come down to our home button and come over here to action. Let's to choose click, and now let's type in the following, S-Y-M dot money sign, open parentheses, type, okay, and we want this to be home info close it dot toggle okay just simple sim dot money sign home info dot toggle now whenever we run it we click here and then it will hide and show our, our button so now what we want to do here is just we want to select just the button not the text so you grab a hold of just the button come over here and choose off and then whenever we run it, it will uh, hide and show our information here. Now, if we was to select both of them, as you can see right over here, we've got home info and text info selected. Come over here, choose off. And then whenever we run it, it will open up, but it will not show our text. So we have to have it. We have to have it so that it only has just our container, which is our, our button face itself. And we want that one to be off. And we want our text to be on. And then whenever we run that, it shows our text. Okay, Wayne Bird here with DarkFix.net. Y'all have a rocking rest of the week. Bye-bye.